guys welcome back to another video i thought i would do like a vlog daily vlog style video today because i am off to ibiza on sunday it is currently friday and we're heading down to Devon tonight so i need to pack for ibiza today i need to pack for devon um so yeah i thought i'd do kind of like a little vlog daily vlog basically i don't know why <laughs> that took so much to get that out a daily vlog i've just quickly filmed a uh, outfit of the day reel i am wearing this linen set from pretty lavish which i absolutely love um and yeah i thought i would show you first up how i've not eaten yet today so i feel a bit like sporadic <laughs> i need to get some food in my system i might actually have like a little breakfast bar or something um but it's currently half 10 i've just filmed a reel um i haven't been to the gym today because on a friday hold on let me prop you up because my arm is actually lying okay that's better um what was i saying so yeah sorry my arm i literally did a full body workout yesterday and it was quite heavy on the arms and yeah my arms are literally killing me so i cannot hold up the camera for too long um i can't even remember what i was saying now um so basically Yes, I've been planning all my outfits for Ibiza on my laptop, um, just so like I kind of have like a reference for them. Also, I do it because then I can literally upload the collage of the outfit straight to my light to know it, so you guys can shop it. Um, and because Ibiza, I am going to be doing a bit of work, like I've got work to take out there, but I um, don't really want to be finding like links and stuff while i'm away so i'm doing all of the links and everything for everything now so it's all ready for you guys so yeah you're not going to be waiting for a link on my instagram if you don't follow me on instagram it's rachel Claire holland i'll pop my little link up here um so i'm doing that now i've just got a few more final outfits to kind of like put together i've not really bought too much i'm going to do a little bit of a haul in this video i've got a few last minute purchases that i made i've got some arriving today um but i've not really bought too much one because i've not really found that much stuff in all honesty and two i didn't want to make any just purchases that i'm just going to wear for this week and not wear again so i've actually got be i'm actually re-wearing a lot of stuff like this in my wardrobe which i much prefer anyway and just having them in a completely new different outfit um but yeah i've got a few things arriving today a few bikinis but let me show you what i do so i use a I use this app called canva um to create my kind of like outfit collages just so i can like visualize them and then i will try them on before i pack them as well um today as such um to plan out my outfits and it really helps in making sure i don't pack too much um or overpack um and i can just literally pack the right amount of outfits so i do have and then you can kind of like see them all here as well i do have one outfit here that i need to prepare and also here i don't think that was in the screen yeah those two there that i need to sort out so i'm just going to go through that now um and then it's just yeah easy to pack my outfits i definitely cannot take full credit for this method because i did see it on tiktok and fully copied it but it's great i've used it for santorini i'm using it now so that's what i'm doing now um and then i'm going to wait for my parcels to arrive to arrive i'm going to make a cup of tea finish my last one two three four outfits that i need to do i oh, know three outfits that i need to do um have a cup of tea have some breakfast and then i will hopefully be able to show you the new items Okay, I've started the organized chaos. So I've just started grouping them into outfits. 
So I've got evening outfits, daytime outfits, like swimwear outfits and shirts and stuff. So I'm going to do that. There's a few outfits that I want to try on and make sure they're right. So I'm going to try those on with you now. Um, but yeah, some of them I've already tried on previously, so I know they will be fine. Okay, you're going to have to excuse the mess behind me, but this is the first outfit that I wanted to try. I think I'm going to go with it. It's the Jack Moose Bralette with like a low... Um, what is this called? Low midi skirt. Um, I'm just going to have... Well, I was thinking of wearing a blazer over the top because I can't really go for dinner like this, but... I don't know if I'll be too hot or do I go for like a long sleeve black top instead. Let me try on a long sleeve black top and decide. Okay, I've actually just popped on with a bandeau top and I much prefer this because it's obviously more covered on top and I don't feel like I would necessarily need a blazer with this. Um, but yeah, I'll probably just wear sandals um, or dad sandals with this as well but yeah just kind of this is like for our first night and we're just having probably like a hotel dinner because we because by the time we've like arrived get in the room and stuff yes yeah, can't be asked to faff and go out for like a proper dinner and get a taxi and stuff so we're just gonna have dinner in the hotel um but yeah i like this kind of like just yeah casual casual vibes and it's actually better this top being long because this skirt is a low rise one so every time i have it up high it just falls down um so yeah it's probably better having a longer top so yeah that one's sorted okay i want to try on this bikini because oh alexa alexa oh my time is going for my lunch um but yeah i got this bikini here which i absolutely love i wanted to try it because i didn't know if it was going to be too small but i think it's okay i had this in a cream um and it's a picture here which i loved but i wore it to santorini and um, we went in the hot springs and obviously it's loads of like volcano sulfur stuff and it, yeah literally went orange so yeah i've got to the blue and i'm gonna wear this probably with my cream maxi skirt this is the type of lunch where i need to use up the chicken goujons that are in the fridge that are gonna go out a date and i've just seen that there's a season three of never have i ever so i'm gonna pop this on while i have my chicken goujons quickly and then back to packing Okay, I don't know if I've ever showed you my actual case before, but this one is from Mona, so I absolutely love the colour. But it got absolutely battered when we went to Santorini. I don't know if you can see, but it's, yeah, absolutely covered, so maybe not wise to get a tope one. Oh, okay, it's time to pack. I'm kind of scared that, I've literally just got everything in my hand here because I just filmed a TikTok. Um, I'm kind of scared that it's not all going to fit, but let's give it a go. Right. I do have, um, oh, actually, let me show you the new bits, the new bikinis that I got first. I got this gorgeous, oh, I've shown you this one when I was trying it on. The pale blue one from um, Free Society. So I'm going to put all of my bikinis in this triangle, um, it's like a wetsuit material zip up bag. So I'm going to try and fit them all in there. And then the other one that I've got, which is new, is this one from Osho. It's like a bandeau and then it's like asymmetric over this side, which is really nice. I want a wheel crochet bikini from weekdays going in. Probably should take the time with all of these as well. My Isabold bikini, which I take every single holiday because I love it. And then also I'm going to take this orange four from Reckless One. And then I've got two bikinis potentially being delivered tomorrow. So if not, if they don't arrive, then I might need to get some backups. So I'm going to pop those in the suitcase. Got some new items from Look Fantastic, which just arrived. And then I'll do a time lapse of me packing. Um, I got this Revolution Rapid Tan Accelerator. Duan literally posted this yesterday. Um, and it's an SPF 20, so I was like, well, I'm gonna get that because I needed something to arrive quick. I got this Drunk Elephant Moisturizer because I really need like a evening moisturizer in this one. I had good reviews and it was on the sale. And then I also got my the Skin Cuticles Vitamin C. Now I've had a really bad hormonal breakout all over my chin recently, which I've not had for months. And it was really annoying me because I was like, ugh, like, 
why is this happened like it's literally not happened for months i thought i'd kind of like tackled the hormonal breakouts and things like that until yesterday when i was looking to order another vitamin c because i haven't had one for literally about four weeks which was this one the last one that i used and i was like oh I'll go and look at this one again, but it's really expensive. It's like £85 just for the like a tiny little bottle. And I was just reading the reviews and someone said, this has really helped my hormonal breakouts. And I was like, that's why I've got one because I've not been using this. This is the reason why my hormonal breakouts had stopped. So this is called Serum, T Serum 10 and it's a dual antioxidant treatment. So it's got lisorbic acid in and a fer ferulic acid. So yeah, really recommend that. This is the type of product which I think I realised how good this was when I was using it. Like, I didn't really think it was making a difference. But now I've not used it for like three weeks, I can 100% tell that this is great. So yeah, I'm definitely using this ASAP. Okay, everything is in clothes wise and then all my accessories and then I've got Jamie's bloody Yeezy slides that are taking up so much room because he can't put them in his suitcase but all I need to get in here is Jamie's toiletries and my toiletries so maybe I should see if I can well yeah, just my makeup bag needs to go in here. The rest of my toiletries can go in here. And then I need to squeeze in his toiletry bag somewhere. Maybe I can shove that in there. It's all a bit of a puzzle. Let's see where his toiletry bag is. He's got his suitcase down here. We do have like an extra hand luggage suitcase to take if we need to, but I just can't be bothered to be honest. Okay, that can go in there with a bit of jigging around so i think we should be okay i'm literally sweating as well um it's so hot oh i've got hair everywhere um but i'm done that's all i can do for now for now um i've just weighed it i got these scales from amazon because when i went to santorini i was so over like i've never had a suitcase weigh as much as my one from um Santorini like it was literally like nearly 30 kilograms which is crazy and I literally had to pay like so much money because it was like nine kilograms over um so I got one of these from Amazon it's a suitcase scale so you wrap that around the top and you lift it up and it currently says it weighs 20 kilograms which is good because I'm pretty sure we have 23 kg allowance so at the moment it should be fine we've got three kilograms to play with and obviously it's just the toiletries that need to go in there which i know are the heaviest but surely they're not going to weigh more than three kilograms anyway let's pray they don't if they do then i'll have to put some of the clothes in my hand luggage case and take another hand luggage case but i'd ideally just like to take a handbag to be honest um so i now need to pack my bag for devon but i think i need a cup of tea first even though I'm really hot, but I really fancy a cup of tea. I've also got my airport outfit laid out on this chair, ready for Sunday morning. Um, I actually want to take that book out because I'm going to take the bag down to Devon. I need to sort out in there as well, but that's going to be the bag that I'm going to take to my, the airport. got my book that I'm going to read. I've got some like, oil on there as well, which is a bit annoying. I've got my portable charger on charge. I need to charge the iPad already. And now I think... That is everything, and then we will be ready to go. So I don't actually know what the time is. What is the time? 
oh 10 past three so i think we're gonna try and leave at four so i am gonna end this video here i really hope you guys enjoyed it excuse the really hot sweaty mess god it's so hot um but i'm not complaining because i love the heat but just wish we had aircon in the flat um i really hope you guys enjoyed this video i see all of my outfits styled properly um but like i said make sure you follow me on tiktok and instagram because i will be sharing all of the outfits on there as well ralphie you excited to go to nanny's? You excited to go to nanny's? Ah. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, don't do that to me. Are you excited to have a fun time? Yeah, you going on your holidays for a week? Yeah, good boy. Um, okay, so yeah, hope you've all had a lovely week and I shall see you all next week with another video.